Simple stocking stitch takes on a whole new dimension when you introduce different coloured yarns to create a pattern of horizontal stripes. Narrow stripes like these and on the square for your throw are worked in two rows of each shade. The yarns that aren't being used are carried up along the right hand edge of the work where they form a loose twist. For stocking stitch stripes, you should always start a new colour yarn at the beginning of a knit row. Knit four or five stitches, leaving a long tail of about 30 centimetres, which can be darned in later. Pull gently on the end of the yarn from the previous row and on the tail to tighten up the first stitch a little, then continue knitting to the end of the row. Purl the next row. Work the next stripe with the lowest yarn on the right hand side. Keep the other two yarns and the new tail to the left as you start the row so that they won't get twisted. Take care not to pull it up too tightly or the right hand edge will get distorted. Knit to the end of the row and purl back. As soon as you're working with more than one ball, your yarn can easily end up in a tangle. Try working with one ball to your right hand side, one in the middle and the other to the left so that the yarns don't get caught up. Some knitters even keep their yarn separate by putting them in jars or boxes. When you turn your knitting at the end of the row, be sure to do this so that the three lengths of yarn don't twist together.